What can healthcare expect from Apple? This is Bertalan Meshko, and you're watching the channel of the medical future. We have seen signs from Amazon, Google and Apple that they are trying to move into healthcare too. Apple announced that the next big software update for iPhones would include a new feature, letting users to view, manage and share their medical records. The new feature will bring together medical data from participating hospitals and from the iPhone itself. That's a brave step from a tech company. But what more could we expect? How could the Apple style appear in medical apps and services? Well, using the iPhone's example as a starting point, Apple might increase the size of medical devices every year. Yet, of course, every hardware will have a neat, streamlined design with nothing more than the Apple logo, perhaps a half written stethoscope. As the compatibility issues of Apple devices is known far and wide, medical professionals and patients will need a massive amount of cable transformers. Moreover, devices and software will only communicate with apps downloaded from the Apple Store. Patients will be able to access all their medical records, but only via the respective Apple device, which will not let the user download anything directly to the device. Every hardware and software could only be repaired in special places for extraordinary prices. Siri will respond to every medical question and patients at hospitals will have to listen to U2 songs all day. But let's put the jokes aside for a moment. I hope tech companies won't make the same mistake pharma and medical companies did by ignoring patient needs for decades. They should work closely with patients when designing a product. They should also study regulation thoroughly as they could present serious barriers to their plans. Also, evidence-based medicine is at the core of modern healthcare and these companies will have to prove themselves in peer-reviewed studies which is completely new to them. While tech giants clearly move into healthcare, I think they might even have a better shot at making patients the point of care if they can deal with the issues I just described. Apple, good luck.